lineup. The combo potential is extremely high from this TNC. Trying to secure the Miracles down here instead. So the arrow on the creep, Cuckoo, he's got Firefly, gonna get slowed up here. That should be... I'll say that the Monk Golem stun's coming in, causing some issues. He'll pop the stick charge, double across from GHG. He's trying burning. to kill him, but he's burning. The Firefly's killing him, bringing him low. Tim's jumps in, he'll be able to finish it off. Cuckoo's fine. And TSC getting a third kill. Making those early moves and making the most out of getting that level seven. Nice and early on as the mid lane Kunkka. Yeah, crisp, easy rotations coming out. If Miracle is getting gone on, he can use that little dispel on his teammates to help him out. Man, we are. He's coming a That's little a deep, really a little aggressive. What's he doing in the trees? He's, he's going to be straight up there, surely, yes? But who's going to make the move around the map? Wow, and which hero do you get aggressive on? Mid lane, another combo is laid out, and it's another kill for TNC, just finding any opportunity to outnumber. Because not only, as you say, it's hard with their heroes, it's also hard to do it on the heroes of TNC. They've got a mid lane Kuka. He's very tanky. He gets the poke down. Now they're trying, but a good disruption. Saves him for the initial combo. Tim's is coming in with the wraparound armor. He's trying to run himself away, looking to get to the high ground. He's still alive. The he's out. out. He's getting back to the tower, but they will kill him off. They'll get the kill. But now the turnaround comes into play. Tim's turns, finds GH. We are trying to dive for more. One more hit on Tim's will do it. He has the south. Taking him back up. Kuro's looking to dive. Tim's underneath the tower. Will be close up on We are. Nice. Get the Mel strike in and finally lick. He traps deeper. Shards, Cuckoo, from the Firefly, so will try and get himself over the shards, but the troll summon it, got the control, Cuckoo trying to escape, and they have the damage. The ganker here, walking through the sentry ward here, can he get the X? He will get it on Miracle, and the Batrider boots to travel on the creep wave. Set up Tauren Pope, start to lay down some of the poison. Demonic Purge, Miracle can do very little to get himself out of this. Won't even bother wasting. It's not a ridiculously fast rush. It's a good time with the death, so. They're starting to figure it out now. Can they get in the pit? The shards have blocked them off from getting in. Armel, it's a big torrent. They're going to try and interrupt this. Liquid, they'll get it, but they get the kill. TNC will get the kill on Roche. Liquid are able to continue to, to secure the Aegis. Mind Control will die for this one. So TNC... Find a little bit of action, taking the kill away. And finally, after a bit of time, finishing off mind control. Yeah, disruption and disarm. Makes it a big nightmare for Miracle before he has the BKB. Top lane again, mind control. It's going to be the one to get gone upon. But the Kraken, but there's the lasso. Dragging him back from TNC. We'll finish off. He's matched up at least with Kuku. See down here, the Moonlight Shadow being used for Gabby. It's just going to end. So GH, eyes on Gabby. Arrow's going to whip. Abby's going to try and come in. In fact, onto Weeha, though. Can I top him as well with Cuckoo and the Firefly? Tim's and Armel turning up as well. They'll no, surround Weeha. The tie here comes in. They take the Aegis out of Weeha. They're going to look for more. It's Liquid. A push to the side. Here's the second life of Weeha. Aegis. As he'll be able to blink away. Now looks to go back in. Look arrow. Get on top of Gabby. Gabby now on the retreat. They've lost Cuckoo on TNC. Can Liquid find anything more out of this? GH has got eyes on Tim's. The trap's being used by Weeha to help continue the chase. They haven't seen much from Liquid in a while. Hello. Sees GH. Should be a pretty easy pickup for them here. Snowball. Trying to use it there in an attempt to get away. Tom will be off the mark. GH with the shards. He tries his best, but the vision's there from Cuckoo. Crossing over the tree line with the Firefly to find the X mark vision for Armel. They're 4k down, they've got the BKBs. This is the time to swing that net worth advantage back in their favor. Miracle's gonna look to start the fight with the wraparound. He's got eyes on Gabby. Jump forward from AU. is gonna be the first to fall. Now they'll be able to focus down the raking. Gabby getting his mana burn by the defusal. We are picks up the second. The exact by Tim's. Arrow is liquid. And he's taking it out very quickly. Cuckoo's gonna try and look for the timing. He's in with the last one. Over to the side, we are still trying to keep his eyes on Gabby. Gabby. Red Fire Blast slows down, we are, but the rest of Liquid collapsing on the Wraith King as Liquid will be able to hold this area around the pit. Armel tries for another poke, but he's already used the BKP. He's got to be careful. He's out of matter. Two big hits from the TA. Bring Kunka down low as TNC back up to the high ground. Tim, he's trying to zoom. They are not going to get it though. We are will be able to secure that. We are in my control. Miracle still on the sea escape, trying to desperately run away from those shadow demon illusions. GH and my control, they're still on the front lines, punching up Armel. Miracle, he's thinking about going in, but he's, he's incredible. He doesn't have the Aegis himself. It's on. Oh, it was on. We are. 
There's the jump board. AU taken out. We are once more. It's TNC, they're getting pushed all the way back. Michael Shaw's there with the wraparound. League 4 for G8. They've found Tim's as well. Uh-oh. No Tim's. Liquid more than happy to stand their ground and look to take this Rex away. Just 26 minutes there. They'll go for the lead in with the lasso. The snowball ball can be thrown down to be done. I'm up past the BKB, but he has to put the BKB in right. It's so much physical damage out, but coming out from Liquid. Miracle with the old. He beats down Cuckoo. Gabby's out of matter. He's got it back off. The buyback comes in from Cuckoo. They'll look for the drag back with the X mark. Looking towards Miracle, but he has the movement speed to get out. We are. He's back in. Has the Orchid. Cuts down the SD. Looks over to Cuckoo. That's a dive back on the Bat Riders. Tier fours are falling. TNC, can they hold the three? They're going to jump in. Silence out immediately. On to Gabby. Gabby. He's got to be careful. Moonlight Shadow Revit. with mind control. And Revit hits on to three. Gabby's dead the once. They'll look for him a second time. Stun out to Miracle. But we are. BKB is back. And available as TNC have pushed back. Blinking aggressively for we are. Behind the tier fours. Behind the ancient. Gabby's dead for 80. No buyback on him as well. Liquid will retreat. It will offer a little bit of mercy, a little bit of time. We are still being formed by Tim's and Armel. I look for the X mark, but Tim's, he's been slowed down, run down. He's got one lead, but Miracle's in the ring for three. We are picked in, and that's Tim's said too. And with that, they can certainly have a good shot of closing this out. The fortification is there. Armel, pushing far forward. Cuckoo as well, trying to cut waves. Nice thing, go there, hey you? Being smashed by the anchor. We are in with the quick finishing blow. For TNC to deal with and hold back at the 32 minute point. It's the base they go, Liquid. Is under attack. Ancient starting to get poked upon by Miracle. Just put him in that front line there. He has Satanic, he has BKB, he has Solo Crest. Throne's going down, yeah, Gabby, jump in. He's going to try for the jump. Snowball comes out, that's uh, quickly looking to burst him down the first. And in fact, he's out of mana. He's dead with that old Sure, he can't aim. They burn his mana, they burn his life. Ravages out for my control. They're all dying again on TNC as Liquid. We'll push our mouth back to the base and GG is called. This game was over at least about five minutes ago. They tried for one last shot. It's the main stage. You've got to do it. But game one, without a doubt, goes the way of Liquid. And you can't help but feel as well that this one was a game where a lot of it really was on the triple kill and some team might hopefully take the game. TNC, of course, want to prevent that. they got to take towers early and find out some of the... The lane matchups are going so far. That mid lane, Armo getting the slight Whoa. lead off the first few ways. Bottom lane. Sure, it's going to go for the self disruption, but TNC, they've got the three heroes. Ready to finish. Here to spam so much that you can pick up this bottle and it's just fine in this sub 1v1 matchup. You could have the same pick you see if we had there. And they're going to look for the dive. Got from here, Crips one burst and a right click. Is it enough? He's under for the same. We've got to find him. Can he oh. get off the fence? Reducing AU's right click. Doesn't matter. He gets the second one in and will still find the kill. Jet will chase. See if AU can get his way out of this. He's got a little bit of a heal going. Again, another root Ooh, holding nice. back GH. He's certainly making him work for it. Nice little play. GH uh, does have boots and a lift, so it should never be an easy kill here. Let's pop it in the south. That is a south cancelled. It still continues to keep AU alive. We are. We'll come in though, and that it's TNC. And we had to pick up the three. Still that one on their own half of the map, which won't be looked towards. But I think so eventually they'll probably get all four. One Rook. lane jump four for Tins with the Star Storm. Kuro's got the stick charges that will save him. Miracle's hunting him the trees for Cuckoo. Cuckoo with the Jukes. Trying to get himself out of there. Pots the stick charges, but they're suddenly going to end up giving more mana for Miracle to burn. And Miracle doesn't even need to get the last hit in there. GH and Kuro. Let's get around and go and scout that yeah. position. Mid lane. It's going to be where Liquid looked towards. They need to we are out. He's suffering heavily in this matchup. With the three of them in the neighborhood, they'll look for Armel. Armel's still alive, tries to deal with the Siphon, but they will have the burst damage to bring him down. A lot of dodging around the map from Liquid for quite a while in this game. Trying to set up on the current. It's going to be able to find it. We are stun timing. He's hit with ease. Tim's is found. GH. She finished off that kill, Kuro. Up to the high ground. Spot out Cuckoo. This is not a fight that Liquid want to try and take. It's especially with Gabby around. It's a body purge from Kuro. You will come out. It's a lot of waste of time. And TNC's very, very strong with the execution, as we've seen many times. 
Jeez, at the jungle, Gabby's starting to poke. Liquid's going to have a little bit of a look towards it. Even though Shadow will be used to try and get him out, but the sentry down, they've got the vision. Hey, he's going to head over, provide some of the backup that's going to allow him to turn. In fact, we could be as well. My control's in trouble. They're straight on top of the underlord. Arnell kept just alive in time by that false promise. He falls so low, but AU there able to save kind of both of his. Isolated for quite a few seconds with that soul catcher, he still was able to be just fine. See where we are. So he's got the damage to kill Tim's in time. The jump out will say no that he does. And Tim strikes to turn, does miss the arrow. Might not matter and certainly doesn't. Put up the spend the reference up. That pops a death struggle to have six to six, but they've been very well at moving around the map. All right, timing set up there. Perfect for Tim's, but the disruption comes out from Kura. Keep we are safe and maybe even allow for a bit of a turnaround as AU. He's had a fantastic game so far. Which we could see them start to set up for here. BKB is finished for Armel. They do want to start really pressing that advantage. Try to get these tier twos. Because Liquid, they're getting away with a lot here in this game. Yeah, this should be, for the numbers that they have, a very quick kill on some mind control. They'll even blow the ravage for this one. Mind control found. Arrows out. No longer can they rely on those objectives to keep themselves sort of an item ahead across the cores. The map's going to be open. AM's going to get that far. Get it lane. Setup's there. They'll catch out Tim. Miracle gets himself involved. In fact, he's sneak off in the shadows and Liquid won't find the kill. Gabby. Look at him. He's really trying to get aggressive. They want to catch something here. He has a DD. They get the silence. This is so much physical damage that's coming in. You know, Underlord just pushed somehow, and Tim seems to be thinking this is the best solution before he can get something like a hex, which is he just queues up immediately right afterwards. So they need other ways to catch this anti mages. Like control. We'll get you brought down here. Back to just being able to grab some of those. Split push where they lose their mid lane, creep wave, but at least have a bottom wave too. But immediately, Liquid, they're not going to allow that. They're going to start trying to fight. He's straight in on mid onto Tim's. Tim's is gone. We'll look towards the final soul catcher. Brings him low. We'll pop the BKB. The Miracle's on top of them. We'll pop the cheese. He's back up to full. He's trying to keep himself alive with the spirit siphons. Miracle's just staying on top of the target. Get any save for Armel. He's going to try and turn with a silent self kill. He's looking himself up in the air. Healing up the stuff down for Weon. BKB's out. False promise. We'll keep Armel alive for a little bit, but the mana point's going to do serious. into Kuro and Mind Control and said, boys, it's time to go home. Kuro is not coming home tonight, though. Will be Mind Control on his own, rifting away. Miracle straight back into the mid, keeping that pressure on. So the fact that Liquid have lost two, in fact, he is. He's nearly turning and bringing down. Jump again, hey, you. Quickly has to glimmer himself. All right, Kuro just hitting the shrine alone. He's right in the middle of them. What, what can they do? What can they do about this anti-mage? He's got BKB. He forces AU. Get down the door to the Yule time. Do they have the damage? There's a disruption that's going to be out of okay. five and time. Kuro giving Miracle more than enough chance to pop that BKB and get out of there. Kuro. Mm -hmm. Cuckoo. It's got Great. eyes on him. Miracle. He'll turn. Cuckoo has to pop the BKB and head back. Liquid, they've got the full team here ready to fight. This time they're not messing around, they're ready to just start some action off. Arrow. Abby will start to look for the lead in, gets himself on top of Kuro. Kuro should be the first to forge the start of the start As Miracle locks down onto Armel, they will lose Kuro. But Miracle's going to start to pick apart the back line. His jumps forward up to the high ground for the chase. My controller, we are burning down. Abby trying to fit for a kill with his beat. Up to my controller. Oh, the start of the to get themselves on top of Gabby, beginning to burn down the manor. Miracle's over to look towards Tim's to sell kills by sometimes for Tim's. He's back down. Armel has got the ghost, but there's already Tim's dead. AU as well. It's a buyback from Cuckoo. Can they get any kills out of this? They have failed. We are. We are willful. So Tia's here trying to to force onto Liquid. Looking like a pretty hard one, though, as Cuckoo, he does have a BKB to prevent that mana burn. Fully defensive BKB though. And back to the Roche pit, we see Miracle go inside. They know there's no they know there's no ghosts. The fight for TNT, their damage is not there at all. If they try to take it to Liquid right now. Oh. Gabby will start poking him toward the front line, but Gabby's also kind of low on mana. Only 300 on him. Well, that's the thing, loses a sent over and the mana's gone. He's completely out of mana. Miracle just moves in onto Cuckoo, also burns all of his mana, so two heroes on TNC have no spells. They just, they, they can't offer anything to the fight. 
Mana is burned. They're held outside. And demonic purge being as well used to keep him outside of the pit. Someone now all fly through. Won't make the connection. Miracles able to pick up the ages. Sleep we are able to grab the cheese. They'll get Roshan looking, and now they'll look to try and find some of these kills. Our dog can't run. Dive. Scotty is too much onto him. The arrow connects onto Miracle. They're trying to disengage on TNT, but they can't. They can't run. Aaron is just hit. running into the five of them. And arrow does come out. Gabby pops his BKB again. The man had gone. Gabby has nothing to fight with. They'll continue the chase. Miracles in on the Heyu. A false promise having to, to be used on himself to get him out of there. They're very tanky, TNC. They don't die easily, but they're also unable to do anything easily at all. These heroes <laughs> and deduce this as Miracles in. He sees a chance to blow up Heyu with a mana void. And her arrow does come oh, out again. Stolen arrow onto Tins with that extra. Supremacy debuff increased. He has no chance at all. Gabby's in, and as soon as he's in, the mana is out. Miracle just diving past it. Don't three, onto the support, running down at you. Jump forward again. It's a triple kill for Miracle. He's just, he's just slowly dismantling TNC and slowly doing his best to take them out of the tournament. Here KB popped. He's not going anywhere. Still no fear. There we go. Now he's going to give him some respect. Back up. Yeah, without like that profit ghost, it seems pretty unlikely. Miracle taking zero damage from that purifying flames. And they're just gonna get the push going. It's just in the racks. Yep. Buster popped it. He gets the piss He does. He's gonna self pick it, fix out farm out. And oh, GH even stealing exorcism as well in the no, back he line. Didn't. He did. Oh, he did. Miracle gonna get stunned up a little bit, but. He's just keeping himself showing there for a second, then backs off, but that's what we see. The ghosts, they have the damage, but can they actually get the catch? Miracle keeps blinking away. GH has this ghost ready to use. He also has a refresher shard on Whoa, Rufy. okay, double exorcism. If only they stack. Indeed, but just having the duration to, to be able to push through Miracle again, more than enough time to blink out okay. and away from them. Armel starting to fall low. Just to the illusions. Get himself a little bit of heal. Well, a lot of bit of heal from those guys returning in. False promise being used by Ayu to try and get him out. Back to safety. We are. He's just running straight into the midst of them all with a BK. Maybe he popped up towards the base. Done, Ayu. Forcing the five of them back towards their tier four. They'll turn. They'll look for We are. We are does fall. They're able to kill the Lash. Anti major the high ground on top of Armel. And he quite finishes above this BK. We finish GH with a refresher shot. Force. He's up to the high ground and has that Ravage ready to play with. And seemingly no chance for TNC to turn this one round right now. Get happy the final round as he'll step forward. Matters burn now. Miracle faces him off. Godlike on the anti mage. GG. And there we have it. They'll tap themselves out of this. GG is called. Cool. TNC are out of the competition. And Liquid with this game two victory will move on two to zero. I mean, what a series from Liquid bringing it back, making it look like, I mean, the group stage we saw from them, they had some tough 